Hey friends, we're going to write notes today on singular and plural nouns. That's on page 68. We're going to write our notes first in our writing notebook. So if you flip over your notebook, turn it around to your grammar and writing notes, open that up. We, we've written what is a sentence. We've written about statements. We've written about questions. We've written about commands and exclamations. We've written about what are nouns. We've written about common and proper nouns. Okay, now I'm going to draw a line down the side of my page so that I can take really good notes. Right. Okay. We're going to write at the top singular and plural nouns. Singular and plural nouns. Okay. So singular, I'm going to draw an arrow so I know I'm talking about singular, is a noun that names only one person place or think. Okay? Now make sure that you pause the video if I write too fast. It's okay to pause the video. A noun, a, a singular noun is a noun that names only one, let's circle it, one person, place, or thing. Okay? A, I'm going to make an arrow so I know. Plural is a noun that names. Sorry, scratch that. More. A noun that names more than. One person, place, or thing. More than one. Let's circle that. More than one. Okay. Now, with, there's a special thing with plural. You need to add, sorry, add an S to most to most singular nouns. To form the plural. Okay? So, you're going, if there is an S, usually at the end, it's going to be a plural. Okay? Now let's do some examples. I'm going to write singular and plural. Okay.
just going to draw down one, two, three, about four lines. Okay. So if I said tree, a tree is a noun, that's singular, one tree. Okay. If there were many tree, what would I add to the end? Trees trees that's plural okay if I said swing there is one swing on the playground but I really wanted to say she played on some swings with her friends swings with her friends okay All right, if I said brother, one brother, but if you have many brothers with an S, okay? All right, let's go on to our textbook on page 86. Let's do try it out, okay? Is each noun below singular or plural? Okay, so plural has usually an S. It means more than one. Brother. What do you think? Singular, right? Crayons. Notice the S on the end. That's going to be plural. Crayons. Baseballs. That's plural. Trail. That is singular. Parade. One parade. That's singular. Painters. With an S. There's many painters. Plural. What is the plural of each underlined noun? So it says two brothers rode to the park. But they, they want us to say many parks. So parks with an S. The girls with an S walked her dogs. One dog found a bone. One dog found bones with an S. Anne brought a pretty balloon. Anne bought pretty balloons. Three birds flew out of a nest. Three birds flew out of nests. Do you see how I leave off the word the a? Because a is a singular, but if you if you make it plural, you take the a away. Okay. Now, on your own, write each underlined noun. Then write singular or plural beside each one. So, for example, grandmother came to visit the girls. So I need to write the word girls. And it is plural, so I write the word plural. Okay, so let's go back to our notebook. And we're going to write page 69 today's date okay and we're going to be doing numbers 12 through 18 okay let's do number 12 together okay number 12 says she brought two trunks filled with cold with old clothes trunks so I'm going to write the word tr trunks. They want us to write the word trunks because it's underlined. Trunks. Trunks. Now it has an S on the end. That's a clue. That is plural. Okay. Let's do 13 together. Bethany showed the clock clothes to her sister. Bethany showed the clothes to her sister. 
they want us to write the word sister. How many sisters? Just one, so that's a singular or single, singular, okay? Let's try again, 14. They had a costume party with some friends. Let's write the word friends. Okay, there's a clue, there's an S on the end, just like this, that makes it plural, more than one friend, okay? So go ahead and do 15, 16, 17, and 18, okay? All right, friends, thanks so much. Kiss your brain. Don't forget to post in Dojo.